what came through. I'm so excited, guys. Eagle had a sale last night. Eagle had a sale, and baby, I wrecked up, okay? All of these stuff, I got, I think, five pairs of shoes and a bag. So, let's get into it. Okay, guys. First up is my... No, mommy ain't getting no sneakers. Mommy got shoes. Look at this. Oh my gosh. It's, oh, look at this, y'all. It's so cute. I'm in love with this orange bag. Can we get into the orange? My dad's in 10 out of 10. Yes, you like it, books? Yeah. This is so cute. It comes with the strap is furry as well. I'm loving it, y'all. I'm loving it. This is gonna go perfect. Let's see how long the straps are. I don't think this is a crossbody. No. Nope. Super cute. And this was on sale for, where's, oh, wait, I'm recording my phone. Let's see, it goes slip. Okay, I paid, it's not on here. I believe this was $13. It was on sale for $13. Now let's get into the shoes. So, the story is is that i used to collect shoes like i was a collector of shoes um i had two pairs of louboutins that honestly i only still have i have one pair i sold the other pair which was the black patent leather ones the silk cakes um black patent leather only because baby i wore them one time and when i say <laughs> it tore my feet up <laughs> And I sold those, but the other ones that I have is the Ambertinis. Um, they are vintage shoes. They came out years ago. And I had, they were originally 5,000, but I caught them at six. Last pair was my size, y'all. And I got them for $1,000. And guess what? I had them for maybe about, wow, I gotta say maybe nine ten years and then the back end of all my heels getting going is because i had a bag of shoes these are like shoes from boutiques like different shoes right and we were moving and somebody mistake mistaken my shoes for trash and we all know where they went and then the next time i started collecting my shoes um 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 the garage flooded and we all know what happened with that so now i'm starting to build my shoe collection back up and let's get into it so the first pair of shoes these ones was 13. look how cute these is guys and it has silver, um, what they call it. I don't know. <laughs> but it's strap up. For a long time, I was a fan of strap up heels. And I still am. So I saw these. I would try them on, but y'all, my feet not done. So I'm going to insert clips of me actually um, wearing these shoes. Just like trying them on. They seem pretty sturdy, like regular shoes. And um, yeah. So this is the first pair. Or if I don't try them on, then I'll just like insert clips because they have it on their website of people actually wearing the shoes. I'll just do that. Next shoe is
Ooh, super cute. I was in love with the heel. These honestly look really big because these were six dollars <laughs> and they didn't have my size but they had an 11 so because i do kind of wear sometimes 11 size shoe oh uh, i mean sneaker um just got it i'm like it can't be that much difference but you know what i'm just gonna try these on real quick because i'll probably won't wear these until next year Oh, they fit perfect. Look at that, guys. See how my toes not going? <laughs> they fit perfect. Oh, God. So now I'm hoping, like, I don't know if the size 10s is going to fit. The 11 fits so perfect. But I originally wanted some gold hills, some white hills, some blue hills, some pink hills, some orange hills. And I don't even think that I got the gold hills, which was the main reason why I really wanted to buy, go shoe shopping. Because I, I only had one pair of gold hills, but I didn't want to wear those on my vacation. But oh well, these were the same as the tan ones, but I got them in orange. Super cute. I love the heel on these. And these are in a size 10. So cute. Let's see what they look like. Let's see, let's see, let's see. See, that's my problem with the putting up videos and content. Is that you always trying to wait for the right moment. You always trying to wait to, you know, have it looking like nice and in a perfect way. And sometimes it's just not that. Like, I was going to wait to do this video until I got my feet done. Because I don't need y'all looking at my feet. Like, I ain't getting my feet done until later. Because mm. I'm going on vacation. And baby. These are so cute, guys. Oh, my God. All right, let's just tie it up like that. Look at these. Don't mind my feet not done, but ah! These are so cute. These are so cute. Let's see if I can see them. Y'all, I haven't worn heels in, and they, oh, they are so comfortable. These were $6 because the first ones I got, the tan one, these ones, was $13. Look at these. Wow. Oh, and if you ain't know, <laughs> I got it to go with my bag. So these I'm definitely taking on vacation. Oh, I'm so hype, y'all. And they were $6. I think for everything I paid with shipping was $84. I think it would have been like 60 something. But, you know, they hit you with the shipping. Okay. Next up is, ooh. Look at these little, these is like the white ones. But wait a minute. I, is this different? No. Yeah. I didn't even know. I was just thinking about the same hill, see? But these are like thinner with stripes and this got the one toe. So I'm definitely going to try these. Well, I never had a shoe with like the one toe. Because I always thought it would hurt, so... I was excited about these because I'm like, baby, I'm getting into the color, okay? I'm getting so in love with color. I'm so in love with it. So let's see how these look. I can't wait to get my fresh pedicure. Ah! <laughs> girl, I'm trying to, honey, I'm trying to get back into my sexy, not to say girl, because. I know it's some guys that's following me. So, honey, I'm trying to get up into my sexy, okay? 
I'm like, I fell off. I'm not going to lie. I fell off. And I was like, I fell into a really bad depression. So, um, I'm just trying to, and I know I was always in love with shoes. Even if I didn't wear them, like I was always in love with shoes. But look at these. Ooh, can y'all see it? Can y'all see it? 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 Oh, these are so sexy and comfortable. Oh, I like it. I love them, y'all. And I haven't worn shoes in like so long. Only because it's like after I start having my kids, I got two. Um, I just like really like stop going out, stop getting dressed. And I'm trying to get back into it. So since um you know when they had this sell, I was like, oh, this is right on time. Alright, last but not least. I got these just to simply like, and these were six dollars. Six dollars, guys. I think I got three pairs. It was like two, maybe two pairs. It was like six dollars. I wanted to kind of get these just for like an everyday, you know, if I wanted to like be cute or whatever. These shoes remind me of um Peggy. Remember what's the uh. Peggy from um <laughs> I forget what it's called but Peggy with the red hair she wore shoes like these with her tights and her uh hair used to be wrapped up in the scarf so cute but yeah these reminds me of her and they are super cute but I wanted to get these for like um if I wore like jeans or something like that and wanted to be cute and comfortable All right, so I'm not in love with these, but they were $6. They're comfortable. It gave me sumo vibes, like sumo wrestler vibes, y'all. <laughs> Don't <laughs> Look. <laughs> oh, it's cute, though. They cute. I could definitely wear these just to, like, run out or something, you know. I like it. I like these, and again, I don't know how long the sale is, but these were at a good price, and I'm so glad I'm able to, <coughs> excuse me, to build my collection up, and when I say I collected shoes, y'all, like, I had, like, I had, like, a lot of good different shoes, like, different shoes that was, like, one of a kind shoes and when i say they got damaged and they got thrown in the trash that's what happened let me show y'all my ambertini um louboutins real quick because y'all gonna be like that now that's a shoe but i do want to start collecting those again it's just that my collector shoes are very expensive like i like one-on-ones i like you know different shoes that just kind of like pop like damn like what you got on your feet like i like shoes like that and um i'm gonna show y'all those so y'all can know what i'm talking about but the thing is is that i spend money on those and i don't never wear them like i they literally like either just sit in my closet where i could just like open them up if i feel like you know i want to be sexy and just trying them on like i like to Sometimes every now and then I do just go try the shoes on. But, um, yeah, I do want to start, uh, get back collecting them. Just, like, different shoes. And then I like shoes, like, that's not, like, known. Like, everybody know Chris, Christian Louboutin. Like, everybody know Giuseppe. Everybody know YSL. Like, everybody knows those type of shoes. Like, I really want to start getting into, like, designer shoes that's, like, high class, but people sleep on them. Like, it's a lot of shoes. Like, I had some uh, Mimi, Mamu, Mumba shoes. And I'm mad because I did sew those. I could not walk in them whatsoever. I think I paid maybe 12 for them. And um, I did sew those. I was just like, it's no... At the time, I was just like, there's no point of keeping these when I'm just not, you know... Gonna never wear them. <laughs> but the Louboutins... I'm never probably going to sell those because those are the ones Nicki Minaj had on.
and when i had saw her with those that's how old it, they are <laughs> when i saw her with those i was like online like looking for them jones and everybody was sold out and then i saw a pair at sex and ironically it was the last one my size and it was like chopped up and like more than half off like what give me those you know when it's like the last one pair they just like chop it all the way down to get rid of it and they got rid of it with my ass so let me show you those and then i'm gonna wrap this video up <laughs> this is the shoe that i had got um i saw Nicki minaj wear these and i wanted them so so bad look at these y'all this is the part and y'all have to see this in low light i'm gonna i'm gonna try to add a clip with low light i'm trying to show y'all there you go this is the low light look at this show y'all oh my gosh so cute so so cute so imagine like at night these things like whoo and but, i was like what is that show and i was looking for it when i first seen it i was like five thousand dollars i said well, who's spending five thousand dollars on a show but baby um nikki wore these in girl she killed it with these shoes and I was like, what are those on her feet? And you know the blogs gotta be like, you know, the fashion blogs and stuff. And I went to go look for these and I saw them. They was $5,000, y'all. $5,000. These was years ago. And then, you know, I just always was looking for them, looking for them, looking for them. And then I couldn't find them. And then I had um went on the sex. When you know how you Google Ambertini, Ambertina, Christian Louboutin um it came up at sex and i was like and then it was a thousand dollars i said sign me up sign me up <laughs> sign me up like what and ironically you know how they how they do that major price drop when it's one left that's what i caught and how crazy it was my size and i said baby add to cart i didn't even want to look for nothing else because i was afraid that it was just going to disappear so i was like i'm not looking for nothing else this is the sh i'm getting this shoe click check out let's go but let me try it <laughs> when i say this is like one sexy shoe this is one sexy shoe but again it's six inches Oh, mama <laughs> see look at that spark that's what i was talking about vintage shoes but louboutins is um painful um the black ones i had them so cakes maybe because i didn't have open toe because i heard if you get the open toe ones they don't hurt as bad so i did see a pair um that was open toe that i might get i don't know because those are they hurt they hurt and um i'm all about comfort every last shoe that i just bought here is comfortable okay cheap but comfortable <laughs> so that wraps it up guys thank you for watching my quick little ego haul and stay tuned for next time see ya peace <laughs>